each year is vaccinate, 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 and boost. New York state health officials are alarmed about the striking increase in new hospitalizations for young children with COVID. Since December 5th, the number of children being admitted to hospitals with COVID has quadrupled. It is mostly in the New York City area where the highly contagious Omicron variant is surging. And of those hospitalized, none of the children between the ages of 5 and 11 were fully vaccinated, and only a quarter of the 12 to 17-year-olds were recent period of time when kids were eligible to be vaccinated and of course this this tremendous crush trying to get your kid vaccinated in a, some sort of convenient way once you decide you're going to do it sure uh, we all would hope that the numbers would be higher by this time the acting new york state health commissioner dr mary bassett said the risks of covid 19 for children are real we are alerting new yorkers to this recent striking increase in pediatric covid 19 admissions so that pediatricians parents and guardians can take urgent action to protect our youngest new yorkers so an unvaccinated child is like an unvaccinated adult they can still get really sick we don't know about these children, what other underlying conditions they may have. Dr. Len Horovitz, a pulmonologist at Lenox Hill Hospital, cannot stress enough the importance of getting vaccinated for all children. As of Friday, 27% of 5 to 11-year-olds in New York have received at least one dose of COVID vaccine, and only 16% are fully vaccinated. In the 12 to 17-year-old group, nearly 72% have gotten one dose, and 64% were fully vaccinated.